when we first launched, um, when we first launched the service, nobody was uh, coming to us, for example, and porting over their number when we hmm. first launched because we were so new and, and you know it was people didn't know who we were. So they, they'd come to us and they'd, they'd buy and they'd trial the service. Uh, they'd try it. Now, many, many more customers are coming in and, and instantly porting their numbers over from, hmm. from Bell, Telus, or Rogers to us. Uh, we see that it actually grows every week. Uh, so every week, about 3 to 4% more customers come in every week porting their numbers. Uh, every week they come in. So how many subscribers do you have? Uh, you know what? We're very happy with our subscriber number. We're a private company. We don't release that information. I, I understand. But generally, a roundabout number. What are you, what are you asking me? How many subscribers do you have? <laughs> we, we do not release that number, uh, but I'm happy to say that if you look at the announcements that have been made by others and you take our number and you reverse engineer it, we add subscribers faster than anybody else in the country. Interesting. So you're... We're on a great growth club. We're on a great growth club. Okay. So what's next for Mobilicity? Uh, Calgary. Uh, Calgary's next. Uh, you know, launching, launching soon. Uh, so we want to get Calgary launched and, and up and running. And then we're going to continue. We're just going to continue to innovate in the marketplace. We, we believe, and it's in our DNA, that innovation and changing the game in Canadian wireless is the way to uh, succeed. So, you know, when we launched, uh, you know, we were the first to launch that $25 unlimited talk with nothing, you know, no frills unlimited talk, but we were the first to launch that. Uh, others followed us right away. Uh, we were the first to launch unlimited uh, long distance packages uh, to, to select foreign countries, uh, select foreign nations. We were the first in the, in the industry to do that. Now others have followed us. Uh, we were the first to, uh, to do that $10 unlimited data add-on. We were the first with that. Now others have, have followed. That's great. We were the first to launch, uh, you know, the high-end smartphones that we've launched, and others have followed us now, which is which is great. Um, you know, we were the first to launch free Facebook. Uh, others have followed us uh, now. I mean, I can keep talking about about the innovation and, and, and you know the things we've done, and that's what we're going to continue to to do. Um, you know, that's what we're going to continue to do. So, do you think, uh, from where you stand in regards to other new entrants, yes. how do you stack up against them, and then how do you stack up against the big three? Um, are, you, are you asking competitively? Like, yes. Yeah. So we don't see any of the new entrants as our competition. Like, let's be very, very clear about that. Um, you know, the the new entrants, uh, quite literally, if you go to the store and you go to the sales floor, and and that's important. And, and I go. I don't know anybody's told you, but once a month I actually go to the stores and I do random tours and I actually go onto the floor and I sell, all right? And I go across the country when I go to each of the markets and I wow. go into stores and I sell. It's amazing. And, and, and it's not amazing, it's how you keep in touch with your customer. But I can tell you from direct personal experience, nobody, nobody walks into our stores talking about the other new entrants. It just doesn't happen. It's actually statistically, it's about five to ten percent of people walk in and even utter the name of one of the other new entrants. Everybody that comes into our stores is either a new wireless user or is coming off of one of the big three. Hmm. The competition is not the new entrants. The competition is the big three. And that's important to stay focused on. And that's why you'll notice other new entrants follow us. We don't follow them. And the reason being is you got to keep your eye on the prize. You got to keep focused on who the real competition is. You can't let the incumbents create a false target. You can't let a you know false a false bogey be created in your mind. And and us thinking about the other new entrants is 100%. It's a false target. This is about taking customers from the big three wireless carriers. So that's who our competition is. How do we stack up against the competition? We stack up incredibly well. We offer the best value in the Canadian marketplace today. There is no one, not one other company in the market that offers greater value to their consumers than Mobilistic does to our customers. If you look at our plans in comparison to anything the big three have to offer, anything, uh, you pick the plan, you pick the brand, you pick the flanker, pick whatever you want, I will stack our offering up against theirs every day and we will smoke them every day.